Hello, this is Mrs. Bobby, and this is Module 5, Lesson 9. And we're going to be determining the area of a irregular polygon. And uh, we're going to use some equations from uh, geometry. And the first thing we're going to do is we're going to split this shape up. So I'm going to use a black marker for that first. So I'm going to drop this. As you can see, there's like a triangle. But I'm going to drop that one down for a rectangle there. And then I'm going to, um, we're going to go up a little bit and we're going to go over like this. So we have a rectangle here. I'm going to use that one in black, black rectangle. And then we're going to do this triangle in blue. Okay. And then we're going to do this big rectangle in red. This one. Okay. So we have three different shapes that we're going to be adding together here to find the, the area of the irregular shape. So the first one we're going to do is a red one. So first thing I want to do is write area equals length times width. Area equals, and we got to count the length. So we have one, two, three, and then one, two, three, four, five. So three and five make a side of eight. So that's our length. And then our width is one, two, three, four here. And three here together make seven. Okay, just so you can see how that unfolded. That is a side of seven. So area equals eight times seven. Eight times seven is 56. And units squared, that's a U, a cursive looking U. Let's make that look a little better for you guys. There. Unit squared because it doesn't have a label. So now we're going to get to, so this one is 56. So we have that. Now we're going to go for the black rectangle. So I'm going to get the black marker out, and we're going to count this. And we have one, two, three, four, five. Looks like five. One, two, three, four, five. A side of five, length. So we have area equals length times width. Area equals five times something. And we have one, two, three, four there. And one, two, three, four here together. Four and four make eight. Get rid of that. That side's eight. Area equals 40 units squared. So this one's a big 40. So remember, at the end, we're going to have to add all these together to find the shape, the irregular, the area of the irregular shape. So now we have a triangle, and we have to remember that triangle formula is area equals half base times height. Um, you can also use uh, area equals base times height divided by two. Same concept, dividing by two is timesing by a half. So it looks like we have a height of one, two, three, four, five, and we know that this is already five, so that's the same thing there. So now we have half of five times five. So we, it doesn't matter how we do this in order, it's all multiplication. So we could do half of five and then times by five. We can go five times five is 25, and half of 25 is 12 and a half so we'll do that and that's unit squared so that little triangle move that little five right there is 12.5 so now we have to take area and we have to add it all up and we have that rectangle of 56 so that one of 40 and that one of 12 and a half so 50 90 96 106 107 108 and 5 tenths unit squared is the total area of that irregular shape rectangle rectangle triangle and as always i love math and diet 